so I just wanted to make a quick video right quick on a way that it's not foolproof it's not foolproof but it'll help a lot a way to not get mad irritated um, or feel some type of way when somebody says something about you um, usually something negative about you and it took me a while to realize this but the simple answer is to not believe everything somebody says like it's their opinion um, if you realize that it's only an opinion and that doesn't make it true, then you're more likely to not get mad about something somebody said about you. Um, for example, like if somebody say, like you're ugly, you're fat, you're stupid, like whatever negative that they can say about you if they call you out of your name, the reason you're getting mad is because on a subconscious level, you're believing it and it's damaging your ego like if you just stop and think about that you will understand what i'm saying like you might know like i'm not i'm not this i'm not i'm not those things that they said i was you might know that off the top of your head but the fact that they said it and on a subconscious level you sort of believe it or it damaged your ego then that's why you get mad because you feel like you have to defend yourself because you're like no i'm not i'm pretty i'm this i'm skinny i'm smart you know but if you realize that's their opinion and that doesn't make it true just like everybody in this world has an opinion you have an opinion i have an opinion the the guy next door has an opinion that doesn't make any of our opinions true it's just an opinion that's all it is. Um, it don't make it true. Like, what are some like if like we tend to believe the things that make us feel good from especially from the people we know. Like, if you have a friend or a family member say, "Girl, you're pretty. That dress is pretty. Your hair is pretty." We believe those things because you know we know them and we trust them and you know we're close to them. But um, also let's say that same friend says girl um that dress ain't cute or that hairstyle ain't cute or you not looking cute today like you kind of believe them because they close to you you're a friend you know whatever but that's their opinion that doesn't make it true like where where like the the thing is with society um we've been conditioned like if you haven't noticed over time We've been conditioned by the media, by the magazines, the TV, the the social media on how we're supposed to look, how we're supposed to dress, what size we're supposed to be, what our hair is supposed to look like, what our skin color is supposed to look like, how you should apply your makeup so it can look beat or whatever. Like we've been conditioned by media to look and feel a certain way and when we don't meet that criteria that is subconsciously put into our head then you know people are like you know they then they want to start criticizing like it's just crazy because if you just really think about it we're all different we're all different people we're all different human beings we have you know different thoughts different opinions but just for example like let's say me and another person going to a store and we we see the same dress now, I could absolutely love the dress. I could be like, oh my gosh, I got to get that dress. That dress is bomb. Like, I love the colors. I love the length. I love the style. And the next person look at the same dress and they're like, oh my God, I will not be caught dead in that dress. I do not like the color, the length, or the style. It's just not cute. Now, who is right and who is wrong? Am I right? Or, is, or are they wrong? Or are they right? Neither person is right or wrong. It's just simply our opinion. That's all it is. Opinions are not gonna get, like, opinions are not gonna, like, magically, like, prolong your life or something. So you're not, you, the, the point of the video is, there's no reason to get mad, irritated, um, upset, or, you know, feel some type of way when somebody says something about you whether it's true or whether it's not true 
it's just simply their opinion and their opinion does not matter because everybody has an opinion at the end of the day. It doesn't make it right, it doesn't make it wrong. So the next time somebody says something to you, especially this video is geared more towards if somebody says something negative towards you, um, how not to get mad or upset or, you know, take offense basically, just disrupting your aura and disrupting your, you know, you could be cool one minute and you get all upset because somebody done came and spoiled your day. You don't have to let them spoil your day because that's simply, their opinion, you know what I'm saying? Like that's, it doesn't make it true. So that's basically just what I wanted to share in this video. Don't let people spoil your day, your life, um, anything you got going on. Like if somebody say they don't believe in you or your dreams or your goals, that's their opinion. It don't make it true. You know, keep doing you. Definitely keep doing you. And um, don't let people disrupt your positivity don't do that like just because somebody like somebody call you out of your name say you're a b and you get all upset no they didn't call me no b i'm about to put them in check like just let it go let it go because you know you're not a b like you don't have nothing to prove to them that you're not a b you know what i'm saying so why even get mad why get upset just go on about your business because people get more confused when you're kind with them and when you're not popping back off at them. Like, people, they confused. They're like, what's going on with them? Why they didn't cuss me back out? Like, and then they, they're the ones who end up feeling bad in the end or they feel bad or confused or they're trying to figure out why. You know, they don't have that power over you is basically what I'm saying. You know, they're trying to figure out, like, what's going on? Like... You know, it takes two people to argue, in case you didn't know that. So if you popping back off of somebody and they're popping back off with you, it's going to keep going. Negativity is just going to be flowing in your life, okay? So just let it go. It takes two people to argue. So that's another thing that I practice um, in my life. I've been practicing that lately in my everyday life and also on the internet. When people, if they're on your social media or anything like that and they post something negative, doesn't make it true so there's no need to reply to it no need to respond to it no need to give any type of attention to it it's definitely not so yeah just the basic message is stay positive people's opinions are their opinions it doesn't make it true let them go on about their business you don't have to reply to everything that's another thing you don't you know you don't have you wasting energy there's so many people in this world that you're wasting energy on and you don't have to Okay, so yeah, I think I'm gonna be dropping these little videos here and there because I just be feeling the need to say certain things, but I don't, I just, I mainly I've been trying to keep my hair centered around my hair videos, but you know, I may drop these videos in every now and then, just little tidbits of information and things that help me, um, and little like little motivational talks or whatever. So yeah. If you guys have any questions or comments, just let me know. Thanks for watching.